Hello everybody, it's me, it's Rosa, and I am back. And today we are gonna be doing mostly a Goodwill shopping haul and also a little tidbit on Bath and Body Works on the um, new, uh, what is it called? The new uh, fall one uh, preview launch. But anyway, I just wanted to give you guys an update. So definitely stay for the whole video because I'm probably gonna go over that after my Goodwill uh, shopping haul. Also guys, thank you again for subscribing. Thank you for liking this video. Seriously guys, you do not know how much that really means to me. It really means a lot to me. So anyway, without further ado guys, let's see if we can get going with this shopping haul video because there's some stuff here that I really would like to like get out and decorate my place with, but I haven't been able to because I really just want to show you guys what I got. So anyway, let's get going, okay? So, and I have it down here. So we're gonna first start off with these two um, little bird feeders. I know they look really wonky and everything, but yeah, I got these at Savers and they were $5.49 each, but then I also got 20% off discount and, and, and everything. So yeah, so these aren't bad looking actually. I have to just clean them off, these little bird feeders and everything. Let me move back a little bit, there you go. So yeah, so here's that. That's what I got with one of my um, at goods at Savers. And then other thing that I got at Savers was this Bath and Body Works for four ninety nine, and it's this. It's called Twinkling Nights. I've never even I've heard of it, but I never had it before. So I'm really excited that I finally do have my hands on it. And this is what it looks like, Twinkling Nights. And the set notes are, oh my goodness, frosted jasmine petals, whipped vanilla, and mandarin blossom. And I've never even, this is the first time I've ever smelled it, so let me see. I don't know what it's going to smell like because I already have my Sunset Glow on, so I don't want to kind of mix too many fragrances together. Mmm. Oh my, that smells really good. Wow, I didn't even know. Wow. Okay, that smells kind of like, kind of reminds me of Magnolia Charms. I don't know why, but yeah, it's not bad. It's kind of perfumey, sweet. You can definitely smell the um, frosted jasmine and mandarin blossom. Very, it smells very floral and very powdery, if you guys know what I mean. Very floral and very powdery. But yeah, I definitely like this one. This is really nice and I totally love the packaging. So this I might not be using up because I don't know if I'll ever get this again. So I might just keep this in my collection for now. So yeah. So there's that. The next thing I'm gonna have is from, um, I think that's from Savers. This is all from Savers. I think that's all I got at Savers. And I think the rest now is from Goodwill. Sorry about that. Okay, Goodwill. I got my little one, uh, Mr. Bubbles, $1.49 bubble bath, because he absolutely loves these. And he's he just loves it. And I love Mr. Bubbles. It really is a good little um, bubble bath for my, for kids so i definitely highly recommend this one if you have a little one and they love bubbles so yeah next thing from goodwill is i got this for 249 but i got this on sunday so they gave me a uh, uh 25 percent off discount off of this so they came out to like a dollar something instead but i got these two little ornaments which we're just gonna open them now because honestly i don't think it does justice if i just leave them in the bag so yeah, I'm gonna see if I can maybe like hot glue this or something. But yeah, so there's these little decorative balls which I'm gonna put in my little silver platter that I got when I was in the other Goodwill place. So there's that one. And then there's this one also that I got and I think it's a little cracked, but honestly, you can't even tell. Yeah, it's a little cracked, but that's okay. You can't really tell unless you do it this way. So yeah, so there's that. But I think I should have taken them out of my bag, but that's okay. But yeah, so there's those two. They're mostly just decorative um, little ornaments for my little, bag, my little bowl that I have for my kitchen, for my dining room table. So there's that from Goodwill. And then the other thing that I got from Goodwill was this humongous thing. It's really cool. I know. It's really neat. I know. I'm going to have to just like kind of maybe clean it off or something. And I got this for $5.49 at Goodwill. So, yeah. That's pretty neat. I loved it. I think I'm going to put it maybe back there or maybe somewhere else. I don't know yet. But I definitely love this. 
So I got that to go. That's the wheel. And then I got this other one that kind of matches it but doesn't. But that's okay. And I got this for five forty nine also. And uh, this other little vase bottle, which is really cool. I know it's a little thing, but I think it might just like maybe like color it in or something. I don't know. We'll see. But I definitely love this. This is so pretty to go with that vase. Definitely, definitely love that. I love it. And then the next thing is I'm trying to gather some stuff. But, uh, okay. Oh. So the other thing that I got from Goodwill was this um, hummingbird feeder because I'm obsessed now with hummingbird feeders and trying to make my backyard a sanctuary backyard for my birds. So I got this really cool hummingbird feeder and it's really neat. I like that the glass bottles and then I like the fact that this has like a little thing for the hummingbirds to stand on while they suck their nectar. So yeah, definitely love this. And honestly, I don't even know how much I paid for this. I can't remember. I'm terribly sorry that I forgot my receipt, I think. There's that one, and then there's the other one that I got, and this also has a little, um, a little, um, thing that they can stand on, so hopefully they can use it to stand on, I'm hoping, so yeah, so then there's that one, so, and that, I honestly, I don't even know how much I bought it for to do it, I guess the price sticker came off, interesting, there's that hummingbird feeder, and then on to some other really good stuff. Um, but anyways, yeah. Two more bags and then I'm going to move on to the other Bath & Body Works. Um, what's going to be for fall one for you. Right, so starting with this. Um, I got at um, Goodwill. This cost me $4.49 and it is um, Wikiki Beach Coconut Candle. And it's a single wick. And it looks like someone did try to burn it, but it's still pretty like you know, brand new, spank brand new. So I'm pretty excited that I got that for for 49 not bad. And the next one I got was, oh, this is back at Savers, sorry. <clears throat> this was $2.99 for this uh, gingerbread marshmallow um, candle. And it absolutely smells divine. Oh my God, it's like a, prat it's a practically brand new, spank and brand new candle. So I'm glad I got that one at Savers. I don't know the set notes for those, but for this one, it says, let me see, no. Okay, y'all, I think y'all know what the set notes are for, for Kiki Beach Coconut, right? I mean, come on. It's pretty self-explanatory. I think you guys know that sense. So the next one I got at Savers was $3.99 Frozen Lake, which maybe I shouldn't have gotten it, but that's okay. It's really well burnt, but that's okay. I still can get some life out of it, I think. But yeah, and it is, um, the set notes are, are juniper berry, eucalyptus, and lavender uh, essential. But yeah, I love the packaging. It's really pretty. I like it. It's like camp winter. It's really pretty. The packaging is, so yeah, that's really pretty. And look at the, even that lid. The lid is really neat. You guys can see that. Pretty cool. So there's that one. And then this other candle that I got from Savers for $3.99 was... Eucalyptus rain. So this is really cool. And uh, yeah, it really is burnt almost all the way, but I think I can get a little bit more. I mean, if it was, there was like a candle at Goodwill that it was like literally like up to here, guys. Literally like up to here. And they were trying to sell it. And I'm like, I'm not buying that. I, I couldn't get any burns out of that one. So I decided not to get that one. But yeah, this one doesn't have too much, but it should be an easy, quick burn. And it looks like it wasn't such a bad burn either. So yeah, I'm looking forward to eucalyptus rain and the set notes are aromic um eucalyptus spearmint leaves and fresh spring rain so yeah so there's that one and that was 3.99 but the packaging is very pretty gotta admit it's very texturized so there's that one and i also got um this stress relief for 4.49 and it is um, is a eucalyptus in spearmint. It looks like a practically a brand new candle. Practically like a, it has been burnt, but it still tons of life life in it. So that's good. And that was four forty nine. And let's see if we can find the set notes. Basically, it is eucalyptus oils. It says eucalyptus in spearmint, and it says eucalyptus oils clears the mind, 
Sm uh, bleh, I can't even talk. <laughs> Spearmint oil soothes and uplifts. So, yeah, it smells. I'm looking forward. It smells very fresh and clean, I have to admit. So that's going to be good for this household. So, yeah, so there's that one. And then the next one I got more. Other candle that I got, this one is called Welcome Home, and I paid $1.49. And it's not bad. It still has some good life left in it. So it's been burnt. But it was only $1.49. And let's see if there's any scent notes. Like I said, oh, I'm going to read you guys the scent notes. Sorry, I finally found them. Oh, my goodness. That was difficult. Okay, so the scent notes for this one is called Welcome Home. Let me just show you guys again, $1.49. And it is um, cinnamon sugar, warm apple butter, clove buds, and brown sugar. That smells like, literally, like, smells like someone is going to bake an apple pie. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, my gosh. It smells delicious, guys. I love it. I can't wait to burn this this fall. That should be an, that should be an easy burn. Next one is a Merry Cookie, which I love Merry Cookie. $1.49. So, yeah, that was good. And then... Let's see, the scent notes, ooh. Ah, hold on. Mm, I don't see it, but that's okay. It smells, mm, it smells delicious. I love it, but yeah. Got that uh, $1.49 at Goodwill. The next one, the next thing that I found at Goodwill was this um, French lavender soap for $1.49. And as you can see, it is really, really pretty. I totally love it. The packaging is nice. And it says fresh lavender and hints of amber. So that sounds amazing, actually. Oh, yeah. It smells very fresh and clean and just very uplifting kind of scent. Definitely love it. I can't wait to, to work this in in the summer. So, yeah. That smells totally delicious. So I love that one. So there's another bag gone. I have one more bag here. And then this other candle that I got from uh, Savers for $3.99 is called The Perfect Christmas. I've heard of this candle, but I never really owned it. And it looks like someone did because it's very hairy inside and it looks like it got burnt. But this is what it looks like, guys. It's very pretty. The packaging is very pretty. And let's see. I don't know. It smells very sweet and cranberry and very kind of holly jolly kind of scent. I don't know if that's a thing, but yeah, that's what I smell. And the scent notes are fresh cut pine, cinnamon sugar, and toasted marshmallow. That's what I smell, the fresh cut pine. I can smell that, and then I can bear like the, that cinnamon sugar. Yes, that is what I smell. I don't smell the vanilla or whatever. I just smell, or the toasted marshmallow. I smell the fresh cut pine and the cinnamon sugar, and it smells good. I like it. That would be good for Christmas. And then the other candle that I got from Goodwill uh, 249 and this was called sugared snickerdoodle and um, the set notes are warm spice creamy vanilla oh my god my eye is just going crazy right now guys sorry um, and sugar musk and this is what it looks like as you can see it's very pretty I like the packaging the packaging is beautiful very thin. it's been burnt quite a bit but hopefully it shouldn't be such a bad burn so it smells very good it's very sweet and creamy and brown sugarish kind of like this other one that i got was called flannel and it was 249 and this one is set notes are fresh bergamot herlem mahogany and soft musk it smells very very manly and you can see it's very green it matches like the jar so yeah this is what it looks like flannel and i do i love flannel i found out it's such a fresh creamy like very cologne kind of scent like very like manly kind of scent, I should say. So I definitely like this one. This is a good one. I like it. <clears throat> okay. Last two things I got at Goodwill, and this is not candle related. I know, I got a lot of candles at Goodwill. But like I said, this did not happen like in two days. Um, I went several weekends, and that's how I accumulated. So I got this for Goodwill at, for $4.49. These extra large shorts. Hopefully these will fit me. I don't know. We'll see. And then these other shorts for $2.49. These were um, youth large. Hopefully these will fit me too. I don't know. We'll see. And if they don't, I'm going to have to return them. I don't know. And if not, oh well. It doesn't matter. It's not too bad of a money loss, I don't think. So, but yeah, that's basically, guys, what I got a good wallet. It's just a lot of random mismatch here and there. So anyway, 
Moving on to the stuff that I want to talk to you guys about, about that new fall one preview. So, hold on. <clears throat> I do have it written down here for you guys. So, let's just get going with this video because I think like, it's already 15 minutes long. So, I want to kind of get going with this. So, the first one, also, FYI, I do not have the set notes for any of these. I'm just going to read you what they're going to be in fall one preview and what's coming out. So, anyway, this is called, one of them is called Sensitive Skim Milk Coco Shea Honey. Vanilla Radiance, Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. You all know that one. Everybody loves that one. Vanilla Noir, but for men care. Champagne, Apple and Honey, and Into the Night. So that is going to be, that is for the fall one preview. And I do not know when that comes out. I'm sorry. I don't know. I just know what's coming out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's going to be seven things that are coming out for the fall one preview. But yeah. And I want to say to the, where I found this information was, I was on a Facebook um, Facebook group was like Bath and Body Works and that's what they posted. So I want to give credit to that person. I don't know her name or whatever, but just wanted to shout out that I am trying to give you credit for this. This is not for me. This I found this out from another person. So anyway, <clears throat> but yeah, that pretty much wraps up this whole video of what is coming out for Fall One preview. So thanks again, guys, and um, I just wanted to say God bless you guys. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. We are at 130. I'm trying to reach 500. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And God bless you. And I will see you guys in the next video. Mwah. Bye.